Hey guys, it's Jessica. So, I have a Curl Junkie review for you guys um, that's overdue. And it will be on the Curl Rehab Moisturizing Hair Treatment. You guys have seen these all. Um, the Deep Fix Moisturizing Conditioner. And last but not least, the Curls in a Bottle Hair Styling Solution. Um, I'm not going to go into too much detail and depth just because there's 101 reviews on this stuff out there. Um, but I am going to start with my least favorite and unfortunately that is the um, Deep Fix, the Hibiscus and Banana. And it's really thick though. It's kind of got a consistency of um, mashed bananas, if you can see that. It's thick. It's creamy. Um, I washed and conditioned my hair and then put this on. It goes on really smooth. It smells more so like hibiscus. It's not a, a horrible smell. It's really sweet. I like sweet smells. Um, but yeah, I put it on my hair, left it on for, who knows, my deep conditioner stay on usually for about an hour or two depending on if I'm cleaning or if I just forget about it or whatnot. Um, and then I rinsed it out and it was okay. Um, it gave a little bit of slip. My hair was somewhat moisturized, but it wasn't wow or it didn't have any pizzazz for me. So, yeah, won't be repurchasing this. Um, it smells really nice though, but it just, it, it didn't really, you know, do anything. It just, it just put a little moisture on my hair. That's it. Moving on to the, I'll do the other one. Um, this is actually my favorite one. This is the Curl Rehab, and I got it in the strawberry ice cream scent because Taste Redbone cannot get enough of this strawberry ice cream scent. Ugh, love it. Um, and I've used this. i am probably got one more use out of this. Um, but it looks like that. It's thick. It's almost the same consistency as the Deep Fix. This one I feel is a little bit smoother. Um, again, I washed and conditioned my hair, put it on, left it on for an hour. Um, and when I rinsed this stuff out, you want to talk about my curls were popping. Um, like, oingy boingy curls, just moisturized, happy, shiny hair um, all over the place. My hair was incredibly soft. Um, did I use this as a leave-in? I, I think I used this as a leave-in once. Um, and I just, I took a little bit. It was probably about two quarter size amounts. And I just put it on the lower half of my hair and on my ends. And loved it. The stuff, um, this is definitely a good moisturizing treatment for me. This will probably um, be in my hair stash. The downside is it is, what, $20, $18-$20, and I can only use it maybe three times. So next time Curl Junkie has a sale, best believe I'm going to get the big bottle. Um, and yeah, this, this stuff is really good, and it smells, like I said, strawberry ice cream. It's full of good stuff that my hair loves. Um, and yeah, I'm sure you guys know plenty about this stuff. And lastly is the Curls in a Bottle. Um, and I got this because a lot of people were saying that this is a good finisher and it helps with frizz. It smells like raspberries. Yeah, it's, it's kind of like a citrusy, fruity. Um, there is raspberry extract in this, I believe. Yeah, um, well, raspberry oil. Um, so that's why it smells like raspberries, but it's kind of like a serum. It's really liquidy, and I usually put this on my hair after I'm done with everything. This is my finisher, and I only use about a little less than a quarter size amount on my whole entire head. And um, I did learn, though, that I have to put this on my hair while it's still kind of soaking wet. Um, how I first use this is that after I put all my products in my hair, I put it up in a towel and let it kind of dry a little bit, and then I was putting this on, but I found that my hair was too 
dry at that point, although it was still damp, it was just too dry for this product. So I put this on while my hair is still wet, right after I put products in, and it works like a dream, um, especially here. Uh, considering, considering it's, it's like 10 o'clock here and it's already 98 degrees. Yeah, the high today is supposed to be like 103, something ridiculous, and the humidity is going to make it feel like it's 133. So, yeah, humidity here right now is horrible, and this is this is kind of a lifesaver to me. I really like this stuff, and a little goes a long way. I think this was $15, $18, something like that. I'll put prices below, um, and I've been using this probably two to three times a week for the past couple of months and I'm only down to here so you definitely get your worth out of this because this will last a really long time um, don't be heavy-handed with it because I was usually when I'm first trying products I am deliberately a little heavy-handed just to see um, how much or how it affects my hair if I add a little bit too much or too little and it gets sticky so if you add too much you're gonna have that sticky kind of not so nice feeling but if you add you only need a little bit it'll keep your hair soft it'll keep it moisturized and for the most part it'll keep it frizz free for me anyway but um yeah curl junkie my first time trying curl junkie products um definitely we'll be repurchasing the curls in the bottle we'll probably be getting the curl rehab again um the deep fix, I'm probably just going to finish up and, or not, I'll probably just leave it as maybe a backup for something, I don't know. But, yeah, that's it. As always, thank you guys for watching. Comments, questions are always welcome. Leave them below in the comments box. And, um, I'll see you guys in my next video. Okay?